something about uh, lightness can't put out the darkness or. John mm -hmm. five one. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. John one five. The light shines in the darkness, and the darkness has never put it out. Right. So Don't know where you're reading that from, but it's cool. You spit on them and beat you. I thought about it. No, we're not going to do that. We're not going to do that. Just stop it. Your microwave's going off. Your microwave is going do off. Don't start. Do it. Do it. Don't start. Don't start. All right. In the barn stalls. My microwave went off. We didn't even say hello. Hi. Welcome to Straw Family Farm. I'm Christy. I'm hungry. He's hungry. Um... We've been working. Tired. Tired. Yep. All right. So in the chapel, you heard John 1, 5. Um, and we're just, you know, not letting our lights burn out. Let's put it that way. <laughs> we're just tired. I actually have blisters on the inside of my hands. I have them on my thumbs. Um, just for the record, I stick a pinhole in them and get the liquid out, and then they suck down, and I don't ever have a problem with them. So... Hey, suck back down and go away. I just leave them alone. And he just leaves them alone. So. And they just disappear. They end up popping and he ends up ripping them off. and They All just disappear. So what are you snacking on? A uh, hot pocket. Hot. You better quit. It's about to come apart on that side. <laughs> uh, I'm just on my water. So I'm good. All right, in the barn stalls. What's going on in the barn stalls? You got that horse out there that you're working? Mm-hmm. It's hot. Not the barn stalls. Yeah, they are. They're hot. Can you walk in the barn? You can fry an egg in there. Okay, so in the barn stalls, it's supposed to be about the animals. What's they're going on with hot. the animals? They're hot. They're toasty. They've had enough. It's supposed to be in the 80s next week, though. Yeah, it's supposed to rain tonight. I hope so. So, anyway, We're anything else going on in the barn stall? Yeah, there is one thing, and he's not telling you, but Glory is sitting on eggs again. What's in this? Oh, that's cool stuff. Hey, yeah, stop it. That's my contact stuff. Eat your hot pocket. It's hot. That's why they call it a hot pocket. pocket. Not they call it a cold pocket. Alright, and you just made our computer freeze up. What is I wonder if it's on? still working. It's still, look, the timer's still going. Okay, but if the picture's going to be the same. I don't know, there it went. There's nothing else going on in this computer. Doesn't work. It's just that it's not a magic eraser, not a face Exactly. Eraser. I'm trying to erase myself. Eat. Okay. Nom, in the nom, barn nom, cells, nom, either nom. talk about animals or eat. I am talking about animals. No, you're not. You're I'm talking, talking about, about me. <laughs> I could be considered an animal. <laughs> Raw. You're just a monster. <laughs> you're a monster. So That's not an so animal. I'm an animal. I'm an animal in the rain. We're not in the rain. Now we are. <laughs> No, no, I am. <laughs> I am too. <Trina. laughs> Your head is. Okay, go on. Alright, so really the only thing going on is Glory setting on eggs again, right? Mm hmm So, um, the outside horse, how's he doing? He changed Good. his bit. Yep. And what happened? He nearly stepped. He nearly stepped. He no, I fell off. Huh? No, I fell off. Uh-huh. He stuffed you. Yeah. But he didn't stuff you, stuff you. You just kind of half stuffed. However you want to word it there. I fell off. <laughs> he got fucked off. No, I fell no. off. <laughs> See, he I fell off. I fell off. There's a Tell difference. him what happened. Come on. In the barn stalls. What happened? Uh, I changed bits on him, and then I pulled on him, and he stopped really hard. So. Why'd okay. you change bits on him? Because I didn't like the way he was working in the old one. And every bit, there's some that are broke bit, some that are have high port, short port, mm -hmm. low port, whatever you call it. Um, there's different style bits, and there's bone bits. There's start name of some. Cause there's tons of them. Correct? Yeah. There's, there's, there's twisted bits. There's. There's some that are hinges that have hinges in them, and some that are just. There's some with rollers. Just hooks. There's I mean. some. Yeah. So, why would you change up his bit? 
because I didn't like her results I was getting from Elvis. Okay, so he wasn't really stopping as hard as he needs to for calf roping, correct? Right. I mean, he really needs to get his butt set down and back up, and he needs to do it as fast as he can move forward. He's got to slam on the brakes and back up. So it's kind of like throwing your car in reverse while it's still in drive, correct? Without putting the brakes on or without coming to a complete stop, correct? Um, so you went and you found another bit and you tried him in this bit and what happened? He worked good. He worked good. RJ still didn't think it was making a difference, did you? No. And so tell him what happened. Because uh, you I had your rope, right? Yeah, I didn't think he was going to work. So I went to step off and I pulled on him and he worked. <laughs> and what happened when? He stopped, right? Yeah. And he, he started stopped, backing up. And I kept going forward. And RJ was like, Hoop. so he stuffed you. He stuffed you. He's doing awesome with the new bit, though, isn't he? Yeah, I like him. He's doing really good. Um, anything else going on in the barn stalls? Did you get the Mustangs road yet? No, for a little while. Yeah. So, Vial gets snorty, but he won't forget anything, will he? No. Star doesn't forget either. She just tests you more. Right? Mm hmm So, all right. Um, what's after in the barn stalls? Snow cone stand. Mending fences. Um, we need to build a snow cone stand. We are not building a snow cone stand. Sorry, I got stuff in my ear. I mowed. Right? Mm -hmm. You got the two back tires put on the truck, right? Mm -hmm. um, I actually pulled weeds out in the front, too. It looks really good for the first time in, what, three weeks, four weeks. So, it all looks good. Is that tough there? My fork's dull. <laughs> you sharpen my fork. Um, so, I did that. Anything else that we've worked on around here? We we'll better get to working on the hay and stuff, but we haven't yet, have we? No. Uh, I cleaned up all that weed in the farm's house, so. Alright, anything else that we broke that we had to fix? Nope. Nope, because the lawnmowers didn't get fixed. I borrowed my daughter's. Yeah. Right? We're not right. mechanics. No. Um, in the yarn farm, you had a couple of tours, right? No. So that's going good, right? Just kind of steady, plucking away with it. Being 110 heat index and the heat advisory, we're lucky to have a few um, tours in weather like this. I mean, it just is too hot. So next week, it'll probably pick up. When it's cooler, we get them. When it's hotter, you barely get one a week. So um, anything else going on in the yarn farm? Nope, got to get the shearing done, but again, it's supposed to rain today. So, and what do we say? We have like six left? Yeah. Yep, we got to get them done. Uh, anything else in the yarn farm? In the fields, I did not take the lawnmower down to the garden. Ashley was supposed to come Saturday, but she had, Ashley's our intern, she had her first interview with Sonic, and... We are a step to them getting their first job. Um, we are their reference. We are their work history. We are their everything. So even though they haven't had a job, they've had a job-like experience that they can be fired from. So um, it kind of gives them a little bit of a better application, if that makes any sense. So um, I tried calling Ashley and... Um, She's had some issues with her mom, and she's now with her grandma, and her phone has restrictions on it. So, I don't know what that means, but I called grandma to see how she'd done, and I'll try and catch up and find out what's going on with her, you know, just because. Uh, and if she doesn't get the job, she still has her internship here. It's not like just because she had to miss Saturday for, any, for a job interview, she didn't blow the internship. She called, she talked to me, I knew, and that's what we're here for, to give these kids, when they're out here working and they're 15 years old, or even 14 years old, 
Um, we take them as, as young as 12. Um, but when they're out here working and they're doing that young and it's a, a farm job and it's hard work in the heat, blah, blah, blah. People that interview them normally understand that they've had to work a real job. So, um, I'm hoping that Ashley did good. It depends. She gets nervous and sometimes she'll talk. And then other times she'll get nervous and she's real shy and doesn't say anything. So we'll see. I don't know what the job was for, whether it was car hop or cook or whatever. But it's at the local Sonic and we're proud of her. So hopefully she's got it. I don't know. I tried to call before we did this to see how it went, see how she thought it went. And so far I haven't heard back. Um, anything else going on in the fields? Because we didn't get out to the garden. Oh, you had some hip camps. Came first, didn't you? Yep. We forgot to say that. So that would be what in the yarn farm, because it has to do with all the interacting of the, of the farm. Anything else? Got ice cream. He's got the munchies. He's hungry. All right, in the farmhouse. Um, I had a horrible week at work. Horrible, horrible. Dealt with the rattlesnake. Got in a fight with my boss. And my boss's dog passed away, and I found it. Not good, huh? Mm -hmm. And then my boss's petty cash disappeared from my car right in my own driveway, which is a funny story, but we're not going to get into that. Um, it was a misunderstanding. There was money left for someone, and they took the petty cash because they got into the wrong car. The exact same amount, so. Yeah, within $2. So, it was funny. It, it panicked me. Funny. No, at first I did not find it funny, okay, because I didn't count the money. And that was part of the thing that we were fussing about. So I didn't count it. I had to go pay for one thing, and I said I'd bring him the receipt and his change. So I didn't have any reason to count it because I just threw it in the console in my car, would have picked it up, went in and paid for the item, had the receipt and the change that whatever they gave me back, and I would have thrown it in the console in my car again. And then I would walk back in put the money back in petty cash and hand him the receipt. Yeah, that didn't work, did it? Okay. Next time I will be counting it every time because who knows when someone's supposed to come by and get money from a car at our house. It's a good safe meeting place. I mean, it, it is. It's a good safe meeting place. It was safe. Nobody else is uh, chill enough to walk past the big dog. No, that's the thing. Is right. the, Just tell him by his name. He'll be okay. Yep. And that's what we... Don't just say doggy. Say his name. Yeah, it's you okay. have to say Jethro's name and he'll let you through it. It's like a, a toll. Like, you know, what's the magic word, guys? What's the magic yep. word? Oh, if you, you know call him by his name, he will let you stay here forever. If you don't use his name, he is going to go after you. <laughs> so, yeah, we just tell everybody it's good. Just call the dog by his name, tell him the name, and go on. Don't right? forget the password, though. Yep, it's like, if you it's... want it, there it is. So anyway, that happened. How was your roping? All right, rope you just didn't win any. Well, now you won, was one in second or something? One fourth and fifth. One fourth and fifth at one. Yep. And then um, the next one you had a horrible calf. Yep. But yeah. you got it tied down. You did better on the calf than anybody else did. It's just yeah. it didn't win any money. Mm -hmm. And then today you uh, missed some legs to win yeah, some money. Mr. Kiff in the short round. He's scared. Yep. So, it is what it is, right? Yep. But, he's been doing pretty good. He'll turn around. And you're working this week for, or actually the next two weeks for your uncle. Mm-hmm. Right? Yep. Um, my goal is to get out and clean the barn. So I got the front yard done. I want to get the barn done. It's got to be cleaned out for haying season. And I need to get just things straightened out so we're going to tear out the shop at some point and open that up so that we have more room there for tack in that so you'll actually walk into the tack area and then have the two stalls to the side so that the alleyway isn't the only thing that you have for horses and tack correct sir yeah that hasn't gotten done this year because nobody's cleaned out the barn and I can't take stuff down if I don't have things out of the way. So it is what it is, right? Yep. 
anything else. It's just hot and sticky. Um, heat advisories for it's 110, 111. Almost every day. Um, I cleaned out the freezer. Stop it. They can't hear what I'm saying. Another good reason to do it. Okay, so you want to sit here all night and do that instead of getting done and going to bed? I just like annoying you. They're going to get annoyed and they're not going to watch anymore. No, they won't. They're used to it by now. No, if we've actually been picking up a few new subscribers that don't know that he acts annoying like this all the time. I mean, if, if they... Hit the camera. If they truly enjoy the podcast, they'll listen to for a few seconds. Okay, you're doing it more than a few seconds. I just so, do it a few seconds um, at a time. One of the things that somebody just during had, the boring parts. Stop. One of the things that people had asked was that because we were getting a lot of new subscribers, is they want to do a question and answer with you again. No. No. Why not? I don't like questions. You could go live. <laughs> I'm dead. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yep. So next weekend, are we going live? I'm a ghost. I'm dead. I'm a ghost. If you want to be I'm alive, alive, we can. No, next no, week. I like this. I'll stay dead. It's okay. Alright, so we are going to do a question and answer, a Q&A as they call it. Um, post any questions you want down below, or you can email rj at barnonthewebcom or rj at barn You on can the web. Uh, email rj at rj at barn. I'll just put a link in the <laughs> rj at barnontheweb.com. And that's how you get a hold of rj. Mm. You can email rj at rj at barnontheweb.com. See, it just comes out so wrong. Well, why didn't you just say you, you could shoot email. RJ an email? RJ because at then you would say something about being shot, too. And you're already dead, so I don't want you dead and shot. Here in a minute, you're going to be dead and shot and buried. Um, now you you also see, can folks. email us at farm... <laughs> see, he's now laying on the floor. Moose, get him. Get him, Moose. Get him. Moose is trying to figure out why he's down there. It's like, what? Get him, Moose. Um, you can also email the farm at farmontheprairie.com. Farmontheprairie at gmail.com. Man, I can't talk. I'll put all the links below. You can find us on Facebook. Um, and that's about it. Um, don't check. I, I used to try and keep up with putting things on Pinterest and Google and all that. And it just too much. So we stick to Facebook and YouTube. So, and then you can email us directly, of course. So, any answer, any questions you want to ask him about horse training, um, just remember that everything he learned, or we had this discussion earlier, huh? It's not everything anymore because he has picked up tips from other people. So, 90% of what he knows about horse training comes from me. Um, sheep questions, goat questions any kind of questions, his love life, nothing is off limits. So just remember to keep it kid friendly. So, and that will be next weekend. Um, if I can't convince him to do it live, he will do it just regular like we do right now. Will you get off the floor? I'm being buried. Let He's me die in peace. <laughs> He's like, let me die in peace. You're a nut. Come on, get up here and get, let's say goodbye so you can really go to bed. Bye, bye, folks. No, they can't hear you down there. Come on, get up here. Come on, come say goodbye or you're going to have to be here all night. I will go live with you laying there on the floor snoring. Come on. You don't even point the camera at me? Yeah. I want you to see that he is really laying on the floor. Come on. Okay, I pointed the camera at you. Now get up here and say goodbye. I think you're lying. Son, you'll see it in the podcast. Get up. Let's go. Come on. I'm up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 19 minutes of absolute, of absolutely nothing. No, you're not. Your butt is still on the floor. Up means up. <laughs> All right. So, Q&As next week, we hope. 
get up. Come I on. died. You did not say goodbye to look. The nice people are watching you. Bye bye. We will see you next time. <laughs> bye. Toodles. Toodles. It's ta ta. No, it's toodles. I just changed it. Oh, and you are just so important, huh? Well, would you look at this? Look at all this right here. Okay, we're done.